Hey everyone, this is Jean. So I'm going to show you how to print and cut the Lettering Delights Popcorn Box SVG. And I'm using the Silhouette Studio Designer Edition because you can't use SVGs with the free studio program. Now if you're printing and cutting on a 12 by 12 page, just use the printer setting at 12 by 12 and since I am using a letter size page I will change this to letter and for all print and cut projects I prefer to have the registration marks show from the get-go just so that I know where to place the design so that it is within the print and cut margins and once I have my settings down I will drag and drop my SVG onto the virtual mat. Now this popcorn box is about um, 11 and a half inches wide. That will fit on a 12 by 12 cardstock and it is too big for my letter size on paper. So I will reduce the size of this SVG to 82% of its original size. So that now it fits nicely within the margins, the print and cut margins. So even though you could print and cut this as is, I prefer to score the box myself using my scoring tool rather than have the Cameo cut out all these dash lines for scoring. So I'm going to change the line color so that it does not show up when printed. And to do that, I will have to ungroup the image two times by using Ctrl U twice. So I'm going to do it right now. I will do a Ctrl U and then a control U one more time so that everything is ungrouped. And to change the line color, I'm just going to use the line color tool and select transparent. So now the black doesn't show anymore. Now I need to set the cut lines to cut. I'm just going to open the cut style window and set the bottom layer to cut because I do not need the top red layer to cut out since this is not a paper piecing project. Now once again at this point I could well send it to the silhouette for printing and cutting but I just wanted to um, change the color of this of this base layer. Now as you can see or I hope you can see that the base layer is in an off-white color. Now this color will print and I'm using a white card stock and I'm all about conserving my printer ink. So I'm going to change this um, base layer color to transparent so that it doesn't print at all. So just fill it with transparent color. So it doesn't show up and it's not going to get printed, but it will cut because the cut lines have been, well, have been set to cut. Okay, so at this point, I am ready to finally print and cut and to do that just click on this send to silhouette button and follow the instructions um, um, that follows now to get the link to this SVG file please go to my blog under a cherry tree.com and you will find pictures of my finished project as well so that's it for this video and um, thanks for watching bye